Hey there, welcome back to another video. I'm Kira, and as usual, we're here today playing some ARK Survival Evolved Mobile. We are here on our solo series. Welcome to episode 4. The recap for episode 3 was we finally got our base built, and then we were killed by annoying Meganera, although Dragonfly. Thingy my bobbies, I don't really care, I hate them anyway. So now we are just respawning and hopefully we can go get our stuff back. Um, this is not what I like. Okay, that was strange. Oh no, and we are in the swamp again. Which means we have to run past all the cat bros, all the everything that we hate so very much. Gosh, it never puts me in a safe, nice, amazing, lovely space, does it? I'm hoping if we run this way, close to the water, we can sort of get away from them. Oh my gosh, no. I think that's one right there. I don't know how easily we are going to be able to get away from these guys. There's my beacon I need to get to. And here is our old base. Still not destroyed, surprisingly. Can I quickly get in here? I can. Oh no you don't, honey. No, no, no. Okay, I need to run. And we're going to continue running. Use the trees to weave in and out of, hopefully. So things get stuck that we can just run through. I like this idea very much. It seems to be working. There's a theory. Not going to look behind us. Yes, we are. How far did they get? Looks like they stopped a while ago, so that's good. Now these annoying dillos and everything are waiting for me. If I can just grab my stuff, that would be great. Oh my gosh, why aren't you letting me? What the heck? It's not letting me grab my stuff. That's fine, let's just quickly get up here. That is annoying. That is unfair. What a great start to the episode. We can't even get our stuff back. Let me just try one more time. Take all. Thank you very much, Lee. And run for my goodness life. Where is base? I need to get there as fast as possible. There it is, right there. Oh, okay, we did that. And here is this guy. I should be safe around him because he will kill everything if they hit him. I just have to get out of the way before they do that. <gasps> Wait, no. No, no, we're in the wrong place. Oh my gosh, okay. Base is this way. Got a bit of a fright then. I thought the cat pros had managed to find their way to our new base. But no, new base is over here. And of course the theory is still there. And we are safe, all right. So let us build our bear. We still don't have enough hide. Oh, cruddy red. That is annoying. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. We need to go out again. Let us go this way because I, again, I am thirsty. It seems a little bit safer over here. Perhaps I should have built over here in the first place. 
Come here, little dodo. I want you. And a hatchet to collect your hide. What level are you since you're on your own? No, 85, no thanks. A lot of dodos over here, so we'll get our hide nice and quickly. I knew it would be chasing me. This takes concentration. I apologize for the dizziness. Wow, I did it. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. Yes. They didn't give much. Okay. Do we have enough now? Nope. We need three more hide. So that is one more dodo. There's one, two, and we're from level 20. Oh, that's a level 90. I'm still looking for a high one to tame up. So perhaps we can also do that while we're here. I think this level 90 is a nice one. Ugly color as heck, but that's all right. It can be our amazing companion. Yes, I'm just using the hatchet for this. Perfect. Okay. And here is also a little lystro. We shall just get your meat off you. And where did our dodo friend go? No, don't run. Why are you running? I didn't do anything to you. Did they just attack me? I'm pretty sure. And apparently my melee is too much. We can't even get a single dodo to be our friend. We need a bat. That's what we need. We need a club. And now we need fiber. Of course we do. And yet again, I am hungry. I might need to start upgrading my hunger bar. And water. I run out of water so quickly. Incredibly annoyingly fast. Okay, let's start jumping down. Um, no, not what I want. Okay, so let's put that in our hot bar too. And where is a dodo that would make a nice friend? Let's check this guy. Perfect. And it's even purple. Close enough. Why won't you knock out? Oopsie, I hit it. Not to worry. We finally are gonna have our best friend. Will it be amazing? Shouldn't take too long to tame up. And we should also have enough for our bed now. So we'll craft that up. And we're finally getting somewhere in this episode. I'll also craft up a torch and another spear. Pop that there. Perfect, we are getting somewhere now. Okay. 
So I think I am gonna do, what did I say last time? Food. We don't seem to be in any danger over here, so that's even better. And we have some anaco berries just to feed you up. Yay, I'm so excited. We're finally going to have a little friend. Hopefully she can stick with us through this entire series. It'll be an extremely sad day if she cannot. Now, what next is there to start? I think we need some clothes. We'll definitely get some clothes now. So a hat, shoes, and some gloves. And then we can start getting all of that stuff. What level are we now? We are level 10 now. It's taken us a minute to get there, but that's all right. I could be harvesting more stuff while I'm doing this. I should actually do that. Let's just get some thatch. And then probably some fiber for our clothes that we're going to need. I just have to make sure she doesn't despawn if I walk too far away. Didn't realize I got so far away. Okay. Oh my gosh, she's nearly tamed up. Yay, awesome. Any second now. And we have our first friend of the series. That's what I was looking for. We'll go on lowest, but I don't want you to follow me actually. Because I will carry you back to base where you will be safe. First things first, I have the perfect name for you. You're a girl, so I was thinking Bob. Bob is the perfect name, but because you're a girl, it will be Bobette. Done. Bobette is our brand new friend. She will hopefully be with us until the end. Didn't realize I just made a rhyme there. And can we get back to base while still being safe? Where was base? Over here somewhere. And I'm hungry again. Gosh, look how derpy this looks. Theory is still there. I'm too scared to go up to it and see what level it is. Because I probably cannot kill it. If we can just make it to base. Oh yes, jellyfish kill you. Sharks, I hope the sharks get it. And there's dillos everywhere chasing me probably. Um. I don't know how our door is still open. It's locked. That should have closed itself. But anyway, how much that, or oh, what is that? Fiber. I think it's fiber. We can make a hat. So let's do that. And then we just need 50, 40. Okay, we don't need much really. 
and we have a fancy hat now and a brand new bobbit friend she can have some of those and i'm just gonna eat raw meat because yolo it's worth it oh and we can place our bed now perfect so now we have a place to respawn progress progress and progress awesome okay so Bobby is fine and then we should go get some more fiber to make ourselves some cloth clothing leave a comment down below and sort of suggest any ideas you do want to see me do in this series and also just leave me a comment saying what you normally do in the first stages of a game what are the first things you like to tame and what are the first things you like to sort of build do you build a temporary base first or do you just go straight into the building I'm hoping that I can turn our base wood and then stone once we finally manage to get stone unlocked because once we do have stone then I will finally and only then feel safe I always get scared by the bits falling off. I see them out the corner of my eye and I swear they are like a capro jumping at me. Seriously, it's given me PTSD from that capro incident. The deathly capro lands are over there. We shall not enter those ever again. Now that we have a bed, we can just spawn straight into our base. All right, let's check. How did I? All right, we didn't have to make pants because I think we got those from a a kill or something. So now we just need shoes. So we need six hide. Strange, we need hide for clothes. All right, that's fine. Oh yes, because the next clothes are hide. Where is a creature? There is a creature. I don't feel as threatened by these guys anymore. Especially when they're only a level 10. Uh oh, I accidentally... Oh my gosh. Oh, it's just Sotello. I thought it was the theory coming after me. Let's see if we can continue that circle area we did before. Awesome, okay. Tillos don't give much hide at all. We need one more. Staring at me like that. Luckily they are all low levels around here. And there we go, we finally have our outfit complete. Equip, equip, and equip. Awesome, so now I feel a little bit more. Oh, it's a Bronto! Dinosaurs feel completely different when you start fresh. They look so much better because you know you can't really get it, but you want it so bad. If I had a Bronto, all my problems would be solved. One day, one day we shall get you. But anyway guys, I'm going to end this episode off here. 
We made a heap of progress in this episode. We got our sort of clothing down. We made a bed. We got our first tame, Mrs. Bobette. And yeah, so now the game should go a little bit more smoothly for us in the upcoming episodes. But for now, I'm Kira, and of course, you've been watching Kira Games. And look at those theories, two of them. And let's hope that we will be safe here 